Hey everybody, this is Pastor Megan and this is Travel Faithfully. I'm currently in Vietnam at a, uh, an amazing temple um, uh, that yearns for religious diversity. I'll move over here so you can see a little bit more of it. Um, it in incorporates many of the major world religions and uh, the symbols that are important to people and incorporates all of their worship into one. So there are um, bits of a mosque in this space. There are bits of the Christian church in this space. There are bits of Buddhism and Hinduism in this space. And the beautiful thing about it is that the people who come together to worship in this space do it in the idea that all of the fighting that goes on between our different faith traditions is not within our faith tradition. This idea that spreading hate and sadness and fighting with other religions is not the compassion and love and care that we are called to be as faithful people in the world. And it's just really beautiful, it moves me to tears even, um, that people would come and worship in this space and that they would pray together for the peace of the world, not even just for their own ability to, to get to heaven, but for the peace of the entire world. And um, I feel very excited that a place like this exists. In my own family, uh, there are, I have siblings of, of many different faiths and some of whom feel like their faith means that they can't interact with me. And my way of being a Lutheran pastor is to remind people that God loves everyone and does not want the kinds of divisions that are so easy to come up with in faith. And our Bible study that doesn't suck is really about trying to untangle ourselves from the hate and the fear that is so easy to be a part of. And I believe if you truly are made free and saved by God, there's no need to enslave and entangle others, that you can celebrate and be free to serve other people. And so it makes my heart happy to know that a place like this exists. And uh, if you ever get the chance, come here. And if you don't get the chance, um, check out some of my photos on uh, Facebook or on uh, Travel Faithfully and take a little moment today and pray for peace for the whole world. If you need it in your own heart, spend some time praying for that. If your city needs it, if your justice system needs it, if your communities of faith need it to extend their welcome, let us all pray for peace today, because it's possible. Take care, everybody.